Okay, this is the baby boy. He is very likely to become the next gen heir. Welcome. The Berry family welcomes you. And there's a fan by resistance cocktail. It looks to me that bartenders are basically the most powerful people in this world. <laughs> they could do so much stuff. Hello and welcome back to Not So Berry Challenge Vampire Edition. Last time Minty and Sergio got married and Minty is now pregnant. We have yet to tell Sergio about her pregnancy. However, I can assume that his reaction is not going to be well seeing that he hates children and he doesn't want to have any kids. Anyways, we should jump into this episode and see what's going to actually happen. Okay, now is the time. We'll share big news. What is he going to think about it? Oh, oh, he's sad. He's sad and angry. How can they not be happy? Mindy's partner reacted very poorly to the news of Mindy's pregnancy. It's devastating. Oh no. And he's thinking that it's troubling for him. He doesn't even care about it that much. Like, Mindy is devastated. She's going to be sad for two days. But Sergio, he's just like, oh, that's troubling and he's just going to be tense for six hours. He's not even tense now. And Minty is there crying. Can you please comfort her? Okay, comfort your wife. Go, go, go. Tell her that, well, I guess Sergio really doesn't want to have kids. He is very young, if you think about it. He's young adult. We'll cheer, we'll cheer her up. We'll comfort her saying that well we don't want a kid but i mean we'll figure it out okay he'll talk about worries about pregnancy like oh you're getting pregnant how can we afford this how can we afford this baby and what's going on with the whole vampire thing what's going to happen okay he's still tense after the talk She's happy about having a baby, but at the same time very sad about the whole thing with Sergio. Oh, and she really wants to drink blood. Do we want to play the storyline where you have to drink blood if you want to have the baby? Is that going to be messed up? I guess for Minty at least. She probably wants to stay as human as possible, so she'll just keep eating the fruit and forget about drinking people's blood. How come she wants to be disliked by Max? Max is a kid. Don't focus on him. And of course, these two materialistic people want to buy something. We'll buy something. I don't know what to get. Uh, maybe some baby stuff? Or maybe we should get a new bed. Get a expensive nice bed. Is there any mint color stuff? Okay, this one looks comfy. Are you happy now, you two? Yep, they are happy. Okay, what the heck? How is there a fire already? I just got home. Oh no, it, this time it's you. Oh, can we? Can we? No. <laughs> Crying. How come your fear thingy is not the, you know, the, oh, I have to extinguish fire. Okay, your husband is not being helpful. He He is extremely scared and is currently crying so you you do it you minty you you're smart you're cool you can do this you're brave no one in this household can cook oh my god oh is this okay there oh god we're wasting so much money because we keep on burning stuff no 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 can you guys stop eating my plasma fruit i am so done no you are not going to like it. Yeah, he's like, foul fruit. Oh, it doesn't agree with Sergio's physiology. Oh, yeah. Don't eat my food. Don't be stupid and get leftovers. Seeing that you love salad that much, you can have the watermelon salad. There, it's for you. That um kind of looks like the plasma fruit that you love so much. I downloaded a mod that has the MBTI personality test. 
I'm going to have Minty take the test and see what she is. She is assigned as ESTJ. She likes to organize anything that comes into their domain and will work energetically to complete tasks so they can quickly move from one to the next. Honestly, it's pretty accurate. I think so too. You see, she organized her elements and she probably does want to <laughs> complete the task so that she could cure her vampirism. And because of her pregnancy, she is having some bad mood swing and now she is sad. Oh, I've completed the elements. Oh my god, congratulations. I didn't even dig up a lot of stuff. It's mostly asking. It's mostly asking my coworkers to give me stuff. Look at this. This is pretty. So for my game, vampires can definitely get pregnant and get other people pregnant. But the thing is, they will, they cannot survive just by drinking plasma fruit. The one that's holding, not holding, hosting the baby? No, that sounds weird. The one that's having the, the one that's pregnant, I'd say, female or male or whatever gender you are, doesn't matter. That person is going to have to drink blood. It's not enough just drinking from the plasma fruit. You have to drink from a sim. I think that can add a bit of challenge there. Or else you don't get enough nutrition or energy to carry the baby. This is how I'm going to play this challenge. It's not a mod. It, nothing's going to actually happen if I don't do that. But I just want to play this like that. The thing is, I was going to have a drink from Sergio, but he had work. And now she's hungry, but I don't think she's going to get into frenzy mode yet. It's probably going to still be like a few hours. Maybe she can survive this day, I'm not sure. Oh, can we ask if she's a vampire? Because really, I know she isn't, but I, I'm thinking that Minty... For the longest time, she's looking at her and was like, are you, do you just like white hair or are you actually a vampire? Okay, she's like, you watch too much TV. Yeah, yeah. Vampires are totally fake. It's fictional. Wretched? He is definitely cute. Oh, we are a kindred match. These two sims will build a relationship fairly easily. That's from part of the personality, MBTI personality mod. I have no idea what personality he is, but he... Apparently, we will be friends. And he is extremely attractive. Fatima's back. I guess she was just taking some time off. I thought she quit. Well, she's angry. I'm getting this ice proof reward mainly because i feel like a vampire maybe isn't actually affected by cold and will take this chance to mm, be mischievous towards fatima we have to level up our mischief and she's the perfect person nothing bad actually happened disappointing <laughs> satoru Takahashi is such a sweetheart. I'm in love. Why are you hanging out with him? I don't know who Satoru Takahashi is. And I thought you were hanging out with Mitchell. My ship sank. Oh, let's try this cause hallucination thing. I've never tried it. I want to see what it looks like. Oh, she's talking to herself. Ew, the toilet is disgusting. I don't want to clean it though. It's not my toilet. I hate how... The task really wants us to cheat on our husband. It keeps wanting us to flirt with someone after drinking the rose perfume. Oh, congratulations, Sergio got a promotion. That is good. I honestly forgot to control him while he was at work. Mindy's feeling very uncomfortable. You're missing one foot, so... Yeah, I'm not surprised if you have back pain. Okay, she is extremely thirsty and before she's going to give birth at probably hot the hospital, should we? Okay, I don't think we can go to the hospital mainly because they would know that we're a vampire something 
didn't know something's wrong with us. So hmm, I can't really do that with Swing. I'd say it's because she's feeling so awful about drinking his blood again. She doesn't want to do this and she knows this is hurting Sergio. Draining his energy, basically. But she knows, like, oh, I have the baby. I need to. We can video call with a friend just to talk it out. Because we are feeling pretty bad about our pregnancy. We're so sad. I, It's a lot of things. I think it's the hormones and then it's her having to drink Sergio's blood. And that Sergio doesn't want a child. A lot of stuff. It's only 11. Why are you in bed so early? And I'm a pregnant lady. I have issues. I just want to talk. She has no choice but to call someone. And that someone is Lilith. Because she knows for a fact that she is a vampire. So it's not like she needs to go to bed. We're like, Lilith, I, I know we're not exactly good friends. But I need to talk. Can you come over here? All my human friends, they're asleep. My husband, he's asleep. She's out and that reminds me, I should lock this room. Ask a vampire, that is part of the mod. I'm going to just do that so we know that she is a vampire, even though we know already, but I want the game to recognize that. Brood about being a vampire, yeah, I think that makes sense. She's sad and thinking uh, about the whole vampire deal and she doesn't that? want to be <laughs> one and they bonded over uh, that they've become good friends Chedrasa. right after that we'll have some deep conversation uh -huh. about the whole you know now i'm pregnant and i don't know what to do i i'm so afraid i don't i don't know what's going to happen when i'm a vampire and i'm giving birth oh Uke is here Oh my god. Even though she said, like, oh, I'm asleep. No, 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 don't leave. She thought we were asleep. But we're not. She knew we were sad and she, like, cut us off. She's like, oh, I'm asleep. Why are you calling me? And then she realized, oh no. Oh, she just wanted to see if we are okay. I mean, that's good enough, I guess. <laughs> it's the thought that counts. But she's a good friend. She noticed that, oh, we must be sad. And she came and visited and to wonder, oh, are you all right? Now I see that you're okay. I make sure that you're fine. You're all right. I can go. I should ask about Vlad. What do you think about that vampire? He is kind of weird. Oh, she doesn't know him? For some reason, I thought they'd know each other. Oh, we can't convince him to... Accept the pregnancy. We'll try to reassure him. It's going to be fine. I'm sure you'll like the baby. Oh, it's Winterfest? And oh, I want to have the baby now. No, Minty, why are you cleaning? You should let him clean. You're pregnant. You don't have to do this. Oh, she's going to labor. You go polish. You go rest. I will... Expand the house a bit. We'll change the whole layout to so that the baby could be here. We are not going to the hospital to hide our vampirism. No, stop working out. You should come here and... Oh no, what the hell? Who are you? We're having a baby. You, we don't have time for you. You are a young adult? You don't look like a young adult. No, stop. Stop swearing in front of the baby. Okay, this is the baby boy. He is very likely to become the next gen heir. So I should look it up. What's the next gen? Okay, the next gen is Generation 2 Rose. Hot headed, snob, romantic, Rose. What's a good Rose name for a boy? Here's a good one. I found this name. So. Ambrose is a masculine name of Latin origin and it means immortal and there's Rose as well. I think this one is a good name for our potential Rose Gen heir, Ambrose. Ambrose Berry, welcome to the family. Welcome. The Berry family welcomes you. 
And I'd say、uh, he definitely doesn't want the baby, so he'd rather go talk to this random person instead of taking care of Ambrose or talking to Minty about it. He's trying to ignore the problem. I remember the first time that I played with babies in Sims 4. I keep thinking that, oh, the dirty diapers, they're going to be on the floor. Or that, oh, the, there's going to be a lot of dirty bottles around. Because it's from Sims 2, right? Sims 2 is like that, and I'm not very used to it. Okay. She discovered Sunlight Reversal Cocktail, and there's a Fan by Resistance Cocktail. It looks to me that bartenders are basically the most powerful people in this world. <laughs> They could do so much stuff. I think it's way too early to bond with him, but I think Sergio would, like, just look at him, maybe. There isn't an option to just look at. Why is it very kind? Oh, he offers to let us drink from him. Well, that is very kind. Well. Other than the fact that he doesn't like our kids, but I mean, well, we didn't really force it upon him. He did not use birth control. He thought Minty was using birth control, but of course, she wasn't. And see, look at the baby. Do you like him? He's so cute. He's so adorable. He looks just like you. Okay, that, that seems to work. So I think. This is a good part to end this episode. We gave birth to the baby, and Sergio does not seem to like the baby still. We'll come back to it and see how Sergio is going to bond with, or maybe he will never bond with the baby. But I don't think that will work well with Minty. I think she wants a husband or a wife that, like, she wants a spouse that cares for her child as well. We'll see if that will change or maybe Sergio. I don't know. This is hard because Sergio is supposed to be Mindy's soulmate. But we'll see what's going to happen in the next episode. And thank you for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.